the target audience of my work. Pardon my already weird voice being altered. Almost um, have shaken off this fever I went through. I was uh, looking at other graphic designers, concept artists, book illustrators, children book illustrators. And uh, overall just uh, seeing the way people communicate <laughs> on uh, various um, mediums, in person, in interviews, through magazines and I, I saw someone give the recommendation of uh, uh, don't be a weirdo and don't be an asshole or else people will not hire you or they will not want to work with you and I thought that's a fucking piss fight fucking terms right there I think my target audience are genuine, open-minded motherfuckers that realize that I talk shit, <laughs> that I am as flawed as anybody else, I'm critical of the shit that I do. just wants to make shit happen without getting in the way of uh, with without getting in the way of as many people as possible without without getting without getting in the way of anyone um, with getting with being the least con least of a convenience to most people two people like a real uh, inconvenience. And it's funny that some people will look at words that I utter on these videos, the drawings that I make as graphic, as obscene. And uh, I'm all over the road right now because just by seeing uh, lately the uh, comedy that that America is becoming, I'm like, oh man! When I put when I put on my drawings, "Made in America," like, oh man, that puts a fight country, huh? Uh, the country at um, makes uh, puts transgender women labels them as mothers and puts them on uh, Dove uh, commercial ads Dove soap ads and somebody can say well, what do you have against transgenders if I cut off let's say, let's say I cut off um Whatever this piece of my finger, right? And I was just like, you know, if you want to be a real artist, you gotta chop that off because then you'll you're, you're gonna be working closer towards your hand, towards your heart, or whatever the fuck. Man, what the fuck's wrong with this fucker? Huh? Don't cut off your fucking hand. That's how the fuck uh, you were. You came about. And if you do otherwise, you're a fucking lunatic. And uh, I, would, I would agree with you on that, that if I was to tell you that, that I would be a fucking lunatic. Now, I'll say, alright, cut off your dick and... Spit it all over the place here. Cut off your dick and uh, put on a dress. Play make-believe. 
oh man, you know, you should be on the cover of Time Magazine. We should call you a hero. See, that's not my target audience for motherfuckers to say, you know what, uh, because the TV ads, because these corporations, because this business is saying, oh, this is popular because Hollywood says it's popular, it's okay. That means I shouldn't question it, and I must agree with what they are saying. TV knows what's best. I don't know what's best for me. Fuck that. Um, again, uh, on any of my videos, you could hit a down vote. You could hit an up vote. You could leave a positive comment, or you could talk shit. Uh, leave it on there. Stupid questions deserve stupid answers. If I'm able to find that, that stupid question, I love answering stupid questions actually. And uh, po pointing them out. But yeah, I think my target audience is, are just a genuine. Uh, open-minded motherfuckers, that's it. Um, and I may not become a millionaire that way, I may not. But at least I can't uh, say that I, uh, what's the word, bamboozled my clients. I didn't become like, like a certain celebrity. That's a real positive person who gives away pennies from her income from the public to charities that she does not really give a fuck about and it's just a horrible fucking cunt. Yeah, there are cunts like that out there. Well, who am I to say this? So, well, my small business operates from... Hmm, Oh, let's just say, let's just say, let's just say, the west coast of North America. So I get to meet a lot of people all along that way. And, uh, it's interesting to get to the meat and potatoes. of a conversation. And um, for those of you that uh, you are watching thank you thank you for um, being a part of the audience um, well it keeps me going that knowing that there's an audience there so you can hear the uh, my food trying to digest a drink right now was doing the rough math when I heard this motherfucker say hey, don't be a weirdo, don't be an asshole Some people, more people will hire you you'll get a wider base of clients I'm like no, fuck that man. I'm still gonna pay attention in detail to my drawings but I can't change my fucking opinion, no fuck that I can't 
but that also means that I can't uh, put myself in, um, in um, I can't corner myself. I can't let my possessions uh, take a hold of me. So, say no motherfuckers that get stuck down to a mortgage or to a car payment. I need to continue bowing down to their bosses because they hold the gold, because of the golden rule, which is he who holds the gold, he or she that holds the gold, makes the rules. And again, the with my vow that I never, with my oath that has not expired when I joined the Marine Corps, which was to fight all, all enemies, foreign and domestic. The greatest enemy on our motherland in the world is ignorance. We become, many of us have, uh, we become ignorant of how fucking amazing we fucking are. We, us, us, we crossed oceans, we have no fucking clue what was across them. We crossed oceans when uh, we thought that we would fall off the edge of the earth. We've flown in space. We landed a fucking robot on a fucking comet. We created the fucking internet. We, shit. And look at our fucking primitive uh, ancestors. They built fucking pyramids without uh, heavy machinery. Now, who the fuck says you cannot become an amazing motherfucker? Who? You know who says you can? Well, I think it's the powerful, the greedy, the, the, the greedy powerful who want more and more power from, for themselves, who want you to feel like little shits. And weak-minded fucks who just don't believe, who say, no, no, don't do it. Because they want another fit. Misery loves company. And the fucking loser wants you to fucking be there with them. At the pub. At the bill at billiards. At the, the park. Sipping 40s. Fucking. At the lounge. Fucking. Smoking weed. They want. They need someone there to be a fucking loser with them right there. So you can't do it. And again motherfuckers. Look at what we've done, because I'll say we, because that's our fucking species. So don't doubt your artistic goals, your entrepreneurial goals, your educational goals, your traveling goals, much as fucking possible.